What's up, everybody? Um, and I know my voice is very low when I'm talking in front of people on the camera because I'm still kind of trying to get used to it. So, but uh, repetition, practice makes perfect. So once I'm talking in front of people, once I'm asking people questions and things with the camera, over time I'll get used to it. So forgive my low voice. I know it, it's very unconfident, but hey, that's what we're doing Muay Thai. So um, we just got back. Um, went and got some noodles. They went to the post office. I went to the drugstore. Uh, then we went to immigration. Then after immigration, we came home and I drove, I rode the scooter with M, uh, mom's husband, M on the back of me. He was giving me uh, tips and stuff. And uh, the motor bike, the scooter, I will get better at that as well. Cause with all things, repetition is, uh, will make you better. So, but uh, it wasn't that bad. Um, you know, you mess up here and there, but if, for me, it's the acceleration, remembering to put my foot up. Um, and it's like when you stop, like when you break, when you go again, like I gotta, I just gotta remember to put, put my foot up and um, I don't know, just keep riding it and getting better and better. Um, apparently the motorbike that I have goes up to hundred miles per an hour. That ain't happening. Um, that's better. Uh, that ain't happening. Um, so yeah, a hundred miles per hour. That's not happening. Everybody pretty much drives like reasonably. Um, like people will pass you if you're going too slow or, you know, whatever. But, uh, yeah, I mean, it's not that bad. Um, it's just crazy how it's the Muay Thai, it's the scooter and I don't know, those two specific things, the Muay Thai and the scooter, it's like learning it the first time, like learning two new things at the same time is just quite interesting. Um, but I'd rather be doing this than a bunch of other things, you know, just sitting down, not doing it, just, you know, not doing anything with my life, you know, just sitting down, drinking booze, Mountain Dews and sodas and chips and being getting all fat, like, I would rather not do that than, so yeah, uh, really busy day. It's only my second day here in Pi, and uh, already, I don't know. Um, I think I'm gonna need this in my life, man. Um, when you get too comfortable, you just become stagnant. And I haven't really learned anything new in a while, like, I just feel like I haven't learned anything new in a while. And I have like the learning new feeling too, especially if you're like doing stuff, especially like if you're doing stuff, like if you're doing anything like physical or you're like learning like a trade, like, I don't know, learning how to be a plumber or something like, I don't know, like for me, if I'm not like skilled in any similar aspect, like when I'm learning things new, it, it's like, uh, you, there's just, I'm basically just going through the, uh, you fucking suck period. Uh, so, and I haven't had a, your, I haven't gone through a you fucking suck period in a long time. So even though, and I don't want to quit that, no, 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 but it's more of just like, man, like I forgot this feeling of fail, 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 fail. You suck, you suck, you suck. Like I have, I haven't had that feeling in a while, but it's good that I'm having that feeling because I know if I ride a scooter every day, if I do more Thai every day in a year, I mean, in three months, in a week, I'll get really, really better. But, you know, I, I have short term plans and then long term plans, sometimes even medium term plans. But, you know, the short term is get better at everything in a week. But then the long term is just do it every single day. And then in a year, like I can think back and be like, yo, I remember when I first got on the scooter, I was like, kind of like stiff and just, uh, but now I'm like more relaxed and it's like, I'm not speeding, but like, you know, screwed, I don't care how comfortable I get on the scooter, I'm not going hundred miles per an hour, but it's like, you know, I'm, I'm just very comfortable with it. Like I can get on, boom, get on, get, you know what I'm saying? Same thing with Muay Thai, like when we were doing it today, um, you know, I, I can't work out for nothing. Yeah, I just can't. Like, but you know, uh, with all the stretching, 
and the yoga that I'm gonna do every morning before I even start the 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 Muay Thai. Um, it's just uh, gonna be. I think at the end of the day, it's gonna be well worth it, man. So. If, if anybody out there is going through the you suck period, the failing period, just know that you're going to get better. I mean, it's only my first day of Muay Thai. Uh, second time riding a scooter, but today I did a lot more riding. Yesterday, I just went up and down the hill. Today, I went all throughout the town of Pi. So um, you just got to start small, take baby steps, and just keep doing it, keep doing it. So, um, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and... Uh, I got till four o'clock. Um, four o'clock is when uh, the second Muay Thai session starts. So I got about two hours. So I'm probably gonna. She, she uh, mom told me to nap, you know, rest, and uh, I'll probably just. If I don't take a nap, I'll just lie in my bed for at least thirty minutes and then get up, maybe watch some YouTube videos on like how to edit better and um, things like that. And yeah, man. I'm probably about to, actually, I'm gonna eat this banana real quick. Got this banana. And I was trying to remember what I needed when I went into town. I knew I needed the um, alcohol and I knew I needed the, what else was it? The alcohol and it was like, okay, the 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 laxatives, um, latex, I don't know why to work. Latex keeps coming in my head. I got plenty of those. Uh, the laxatives, the alcohol. Uh, I was looking for like a toothbrush holder, but I think I'm just gonna use that bag. And then I needed, uh, what else did I need? I needed, um, oh, dishwashing soap. But she said I already have dishwashing soap in the basket. Um, but it's very low, so, but I'll just finish that out and then um, buy it. But honestly, I might not even need it because I don't think there's gonna be a day that I don't go into town. Like if it's raining or something, then I'll probably chill. But like a day, like especially like a Sunday where we don't even have more time. Like I don't plan on just staying here in my quarantine guest house. You know, we already had that. We already did that. So um, I should have been closed that. Um, 